Well, I'm a parent. I have two little kids, and I identified with it because it seemed um, honest in its depiction of parents and kids and how having kids completely changes a person's life in all the best ways. And, uh, and I, think, I think kids could relate, and I think kids enjoyed the humor, and I think parents related to what, what kids bring to the equation. And it's, I don't know, I think in that sense it's very universal. But it's also really funny and, uh, and exciting and very silly at times. Um, and who doesn't love the minions? I mean, come on. Little yellow creatures, that's, you know, everybody has to have a minion. My son wanted a minion after he saw it. He thought they were real things. Can we get one? It's like he wanted a pet minion somehow. I like to describe Gru as a man with a heart of bronze. It's not gold, but it's pretty good. You know, it's, uh, he tries very hard. He is, he's still despicable, but there are absolutely good and warm, pleasant traits to him. But he's not somebody that you should push too hard or, or you, will fear, you will feel his wrath. One of his daughters starts to enter the dating scene and that is an enormous transition for him, as I think it is for most dads. When they see their daughters maturing and becoming interested in boys, uh, suddenly they're not the apple of their daughter's eyes, and there's, a, I think, a, there's a, I wouldn't even say a jealousy, but there is a, um, a tension that comes about between a father and a potential suitor, and that that you see protective dad in this movie, and it's something that that you haven't seen up until this point from Gru, so it's interesting to see. Lucy is pretty loopy, but she's very effective. She's, she's good at what she does, almost counterintuitively, um, and incredibly off-putting to Gru at first. Somebody that uh, annoys him, uh, who is sort of the antithesis of who he is. She's very perky and, and very talkative and, uh, and flighty and a little clumsy. Um, but also gives as good as she gets. She does not take any guff from Gru. So um, I think he is simultaneously repulsed and intrigued by Lucy. I think that El Macho is running his organization out of this, this mall, this indoor mall. So Gru is brought in to man one of the mall shops to try to get a better, uh, a better look at some of the potential, um, potential candidates, uh, potential um, suspects. I love Kristen Wiig. I just think she is, she's, she's always funny. She is never not funny. Her character, her voices, and she's done so many different voices for different things. They're always incredibly well-defined, and this is no exception. She, she really, you know, it's a cliche, but you, you bring a character to life, she, it's what she does. And, and whether it's on SNL or in Bridesmaids or in any of the other things that she's done, um, I've been a fan of hers for a, a long time, and uh, I, it's, it's, I'm really thankful that she's in this.